Hi, my name is Mikkel Sørensen. I'm the CEO and co-founder of Omnio, where we make a product called Omnio Edge, which makes it fast and easy to get unified data from industrial devices, such as these, into solutions like Azure IoT Central. Why are we building this thing in the first place? Well, back 10 years ago, my co-founder and I were working in industry, actually trying to connect assets like these in order to make you know, new digital products or, or cost savings. And we found it extremely difficult to do because we had to read a lot of manuals. And then you realize that even though you have two devices that do the same thing, they're the same type of device, the data looks completely different in the two. So if you want to connect multiple of them, which you always want, you're going to have a hard time both getting the data out and standardizing it or unifying it, as we call it. OmniEdge solves all that. So let's show you how easy it can be. Right, here we are in the Omnio Edge configuration portal, where we set up a configuration that the Omnio Edge runtime will then use to fetch data, unify it, and deliver it to the cloud. And here we've already set up an Azure IoT Central connection with a destination and a SaaS token. Then we've set up a single device, this thing right here. And then we'll add another one, which is the power meter up here. We click Add Device. We look at the list of manufacturers and find the one that we need. And we find the device that we need, and we pick the firmware version that we need. We've already read thousands of manuals in order to do this, so you don't have to. We'll give it a name, so it has a name in Azure IoT Central, and put in the IP address of the device and the slave ID. Next, we get to choose the data that we have added to the database. And in this case, we'll just choose all of it. We could choose a subset. We could choose one, we could choose many, doesn't matter. And we can set up how often we get the data and whether we want it on every change or whether the change has to be of some magnitude before we want to see new data. The most important thing here is the little Omnio logo in front of the data, which means that we've standardized this. So this is a power meter that you're looking at here. And it means that this power meter and this power meter will be following exactly the same standardized data model. So you can trust that any power meter that you connect to an application with Omnio Edge will plug and play the data into the application. Right, we click Finish, and now we click Save and Deploy. And in the background, we then use the APIs of Azure IoT Central to create devices, create device uh, definitions, and actually do both provisioning and authentication of the devices on the Azure IoT Central. So let's go and see what we created. Here we have some device templates, and these are the two that we've created for this purpose by the APIs. And they'll be full of uh, data, and they'll be showing both the names, the semantic names, the categories, and the semantic types and the units. But this is not what you want. You want to see some data that's coming live on the screen, and you want to see it in seconds, right? And that's what Azure IoT Central is so very good at when you use it together with products like Omni Edge. Right? You can basically just build a dashboard that in seconds will be getting you live data from the devices and showing it on screen. So you can start troubleshooting it. You can start learning about your energy consumption from your power meters. You can start predicting failures from your drives. And you can actually also start more advanced features like doing jobs and rules to trigger events and workflows. This is how easy IoT actually has to be for it to be really meaningful. It has to deliver value within a couple of minutes. And I think that's what we can do here. Thank you very much for watching.